Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how you can go ahead and change the background of the logon screen on your Windows 7. You can accomplish that by tweaking the register settings a little bit. And to do that, first open the run command. You do that by pressing Windows R, type R-E-G-E-D-I-T, and it stands for Registry Editor. And you can see five different options under that. Uh, expand the one that says HK Local Machine. Under that, go to Software, expand it, go to Microsoft, go ahead and expand it and you search for Windows under Microsoft there it is expand Windows as well expand current version under Windows and there is something called as authentication expand it go to logon UI expand that as well and background select background under logon UI here you'll have two items by default one that says default and one that says OEM background double click on OEM background here you'll have the value data set as 0 by default make it 1 click on OK so you're done with the registry settings next what you're going to do is open local group policy editor open the run command again gpedit.msc that opens up local group policy editor for you here you can see under the computer configuration uh, administrative templates expand it expand system under that and you can see something called this logon uh, and if you click on that you'll get all these settings and you'll have a setting at the last saying always use custom logon background and it's not configured and double click on that setting and enable it click apply apply the settings and you're done and you're done with the settings and next what you're going to do is set the image that you want as the background for the logon screen Open my computer, go to local disk C, Windows, go to system32 folder. And then you go to a folder called as OOB. O -O -B. You don't get these directories by default in Windows 7. You have to create these folders. Click on your folder, create a folder called info. Under info, you create another new folder that says backgrounds. And here you put whatever the image you want to be set as the background for the logon screen. I use the image I have right here. And yeah, you have to rename this image as background default. You have to do that. Background default basically this is the file name that the Windows operating system recognizes. And make sure that it's of the JPG format by default. That's it, you're done. You can go ahead and check if your changes have taken place by pressing Windows L. That will lock your screen and the new image that you put as background default will be set as the background of the logon screen. And that's it for today, guys. See you again in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe.